last few months have been really awesome. Um, just from the first couple of weeks when I met Coach Abe and her staff, you can tell that Coach Abe is really awesome. Like she's all about empowering women and academics and family. It's truly a blessing to have someone that's willing to do anything to help you grow as a basketball player as well as an individual. She wants us to go out in life and be productive. Growing up, I didn't have a lot of role models, so I wanted to make sure our young women could emulate another woman out there in the community, and so basketball's awesome, but this is just a platform to get women to their next journeys. She talks about it 24-7, um, which is really good for me to have a coach, you know, care about ladies. I think it's rare because not only has she won, but she's been in the situation before when she's turning programs around and sets you up as an individual. And when you feel confident about what your future holds and, and the steps you're taking to get to that future, you feel more confident about yourself, about your play, about everything. As we do all that building, once we step on the court, they're very confident, you know, and I'm a big believer in women need to help women. To see Nyla want to be a pediatrician, that's super exciting to me. You know, Jocelyn wants to be an engineer. Um, I've already connected her with some engineers here. She's setting us up so that when we graduate, we're okay and we don't have to depend on anyone else. I really do believe that they're buying into her philosophy and understanding that it's about empowering each other and being positive and the results are, are remarkable. She really means what she says. She's so confident that because she walks in and she commands so much attention, you're like, that looks good. Like, I'm trying to be like that when I grow up. You know, when I first met Coach Abe at, at the University of Maine, something about her, the way she walks into a room, the, the confidence that she has, I mean, it empowered me immediately. And I walk shoulders back, head tall. Our goal here at UCF is to get the students involved. I mean, we want to get them excited about women's basketball. We had a clinic and just show them positive energy and it will be a lot of fun to come to our games and obviously student support is going to be huge for us. They were sleeping on us and you know women's basketball they're like oh they're not going to hit you that hard. Oh this is not going to be that hard I can do it. But when they see how much our student athletes work every single day day in and day out and they get beat up and I coach the post players and I got my suit jacket on but you can't really see my muscles but you know I'm kind of strong so I think that it was good for them to see like wow they really put in work every single day. We kind of did the exact same thing like if we were in practice. We told them to tuck in their shirts, put their hands behind their back, they did push-ups if they wasn't listening. The clinic was actually really awesome. It was my first time doing anything like that. For them to get to see a little bit of what we do every single day to just see the feedback they got in that they just get to know you as a person a little bit better and you get to form connections with them as well. I had a lot of them come up to us after and say like, wow, you guys really broke. Thank you so much for pushing me and it wasn't even half of what we do. Well, I think it's really big going back to role models. I, I feel like our players have to be that. I think really life is all about like what you give to others. And Coach Abe is a coach that really understands that concept and she embraces that concept. So she's all about getting into the community, giving back to other people and since I have like-minded views. You know, it's heartwarming to me to play under a coach that's willing to, you know, get out in the community. I think kids today need good, strong, positive role models, and especially academically, too. I mean, our student athletes are great students right now, and, um, you know, going into the elementary schools and the middle schools, you know, I, I really want our players to give back all the time because once they were once there. Obviously, I want them to come back to our games and support and scream, but I'm really big on the role model part. Mission Sight is our theme for this year and currently looking at our student athletes right now, we wanted them to have a vision of what's ahead of them. So the underlying theme is, you know, let's get better every day, let's do something every single day to get better. That's getting better as a player, that's getting better as a person. You're not just playing for one game, you're not playing for two games, you're playing for something bigger. The mission is for you to be a, a successful member of society that is making a difference. So once you graduate and you take all these different things that she's instilled in us to the next level, you're just going to be successful all around. I want them to have a vision of where they're going and what their plan is and stop living so much in the now because these four years go by so fast. And so it's mission in sight for basketball, but it's also mission in sight for life.